Hi guys and welcome! Today we are gonna learn how to make a simple water level detection for our coffee machine using our Udo Neo and the Udo IoT Cloud Platform. First, we need to connect the board to the cloud. If you don't remember how, watch the video you can find in the info cards. Once you've done it, we can move to the second step, the hardware setup. Let's see what we need to complete our task. An already prepared Udo Neo, a water level sensor, a simple LED or a buzzer, some standard jumper wires, a 12 volts 2 amperes power adapter, and a coffee machine of course. Let's connect 3 female male jumper wires to the water level sensor, like shown here. One for the minus, one for the plus and one for the S. Recognize the three wires, remember to use three different colors. Now plug the minus wire to the ground, the plus one to the 3.3 pin and finally the S wire to the A0 pin. For the LED, remember to connect positive long leg to the pin 12 and the negative short leg to the ground. Of course, you can replace the LED with whatever actuator you want to use. We decided to get one of our funny buzzers. Open it with a screwdriver and solder two main male jumper wires to these two contact points. In this way, every time the circuit will be closed, the buzzer will buzz and lights up. Finally, we can power on the board. To test the sensor, we placed it in a small glass, then we added some water. Now, let's concentrate to the software part. Enter in your cloud dashboard. Make sure the Udo Neo is connected and enter the Arduino device. Add a new sensor. Pin type Analog Grid. Pin number is 0. Give it a custom name and icon, then set the refresh time to 2 seconds. When it's inside the water, it shows a value of 400 or more, but when it's not, the value drops drastically. We use this value to set up the trigger to do the magic in a few moments. But first, we also need to add the actuator. Select the pin type digital output, the pin number 12, and again a custom name and icon. Now let's set the trigger. Give it a name, then fill the if section. The gateway is our Udo Neo called coffee machine. The sensor is the water level. The sensor type is value. And now the logic. We declare that something should happen when the value is lower than 200. In the then section, we declare to use the actuator we added in our gateway. The buzzer we called alarm. Set the on value to 0 and the off value to 1. Then save. As long as the trigger status is off, nothing happens. But when the status turns to on, it means that the sensor is detecting a lower level value activating the buzzer. Easy and useful! Now let's see our little prototype in action. Enjoy your coffee!